Hello friends, in this video we are going to learn about geolocation. So whenever uh, you can see that some most of the apps are uh, first of all assessing your location like what is your current location. So we are going to check the latitude and longitude then we will pass the backend APIs so to retrieve all the data accordingly. So we are going to use that assess look. We are going to permissions the location from the Android application. So let's start the tutorial. So first of all, so we are going to init the program. So let me go to this one. NPX init location. So it will going to create a new React Native app. So all the tutorials of my React Native is latest one, latest version. And um, <clears throat> you can see that that we are not you are if you are using the latest one. So if you are following my tutorials, it will not going to break any kind of things if. So uh, installing the dependencies currently. Next, we go to the project that is location. Sorry, CD uh, location. Okay, clear. After this, we need to install the geo uh, package npm. That is geo location. If you we really need to add this one npm install react native community so this is installed you can see that we have the package of this one you can see react native geolocations so after that we need to go to the android manifest so you need to go to the android manifest android uh, react native location android app source main android and we will going to add these permissions first of all uh, in the top there is the internet permission now we are going to use ss find location correct now we will uh, close this both terminals okay a uh, location we are on the location mode and uh, let's open this one also uh, so we have added let's we are going to add the code for the geolocation. So what this they have the functions like navigator.geolocation, react native community geolocations, get current position. We have we have current position, lat, long. So we are going to get all this functionality. Let's go to the app uh, app.js file. So in the app.js file, go to the location. First of all, copy the Android local dot properties other otherwise it will give you the issue go to the location Android this file is important local dot properties for SDK where it resides so my SDK is home generally in Ubuntu it is here right so after this we need to go to the location we have to go for the app.js and here we are going to change the whole functionality I have already make it so I'm going to copy and paste it right and uh, first of all we will sync this with the help of the gradle open the open uh, we have the geolocation let's uh, close and open we have location module let's sync it first with the help of gradle uh, with android studio so i'm syncing the project so gradle syncing After this, we will run the command that is npm react native run android and here we will npm react native cache so let complete first it is completed now so we are going to run the command and we will start this one and we will run this android native so it will going to build the application
so let's see what exactly it's So it is installing the build you can see that build is installing location it's opening now so it it is asking for the allow location to use the location information of this device so i'm going to allow this location and it is fetching the location of mine latitude and the longitude right so you can uh, like uh, any of the application whenever you want something you want to do with the like uh, location latitude and the longitude that so that we can use this uh, module and uh, you can do the rest of the process with the help of the longitude and the latitude right you can also get the address uh, google uh, google apis are there where you need to put the api key and you will get the address also like currently we are and you can uh, for uh, the, currently we have just uh, showing the longitude and longitude longitude and latitude after this you can show it in the into the map also you need to just pass longitude and longitude latitude to the maps and it will show you the current location of that uh, that we have access to the device right so this is that that is that's it that we have able to successfully fetch the longitude and longitude latitude so let's first of all go to the code app.js what we have done right so let's go to the app.js so so first of all let's uh, read the top to bottom code so here we uh, this is all about the button permissions android and right geolocation we have imported from the react native okay so here we have the application we have current uh, lat long set lat long this, this is basically the states current lat long sets current lat long right again current latitude current lo latit uh, latitude set current latitude then location status what the status of the, the in the use effect that calls whenever it is run so we will check whether the platform is os that we will this one else we will try android with permissions android so this is in the this file and request the permissions ss find location you know that ss find dot location we have put it into the android permissions right so we are getting into the permissions android find locations title location ss required this apps in ss right if granted then we will hit the two functions right and set the location and uh, according to do we will do the uh, one time locations so we are getting the location you are here this and uh, after that we will printing the position dot latitude longitude and the latitude right and uh, setting the longitude then we will set the state current state current longitude and the latitude and if it is not set then we will show the error that there is something went wrong they are not fetching the key and something like that right so this is how we can um, uh, use the geolocation in the react native uh, if you want the code then definitely write in the comment box I, or comment box i will share the whole exactly code and also any any issue you are facing just let me know in the comment box thank you so much for watching this video have a great day